Welcome to the Kim D. Snyder Show. This is episode number 071. It is Friday, September 3rd, 2021, day 22 on my journey. My question is, should you count down or up to your goal? Let me explain. I'm on a journey to have my business make a million dollars by December of 2023. So sh I've been counting day 22, day 23, day 24. Should I actually reverse it and say I have 180, 100, sorry, 830 days to go? Or should I say I have 121 weeks to go and start counting down and then 120 weeks? What have you found that's been more motivational? Or maybe I give it a frame of reference. It is day 22 out of uh, day 830. You know, not that I'm going to hit a million exactly on the 31st of December, but it is an interesting um, concept. And on episode number 066, I talked about putting a date on it. And I was inspired by a friend to do that. And, you know, so putting a date on it. So now, you know, I have a finite timeline that I'm aiming for. Before when I started this journey, it was like, okay, let's just go. But now I have a goal and I like to work towards a goal. And I've kind of been working towards that anyways, but I didn't have an end point. So I do like this, but I'm wondering what's going to help me. I do kind of like this day thing. I think I'll probably end up switching it up a little bit because I do like the frame of reference. I like to see that, you know, I'm not even at quarter one and I've got, let's see, 20, how many more quarters? I've got like four, eight, nine more quarters to go. Okay, well, that makes things a little different if I'm in quarter one. I guess I'm actually in quarter one out of eight, nine, yeah, nine, nine more quarters to go. So just giving yourself that framework of reference, does that motivate you or unmotivate you? What is the best way for you to do that? I am curious to hear from you. So please post your comment below and don't forget to subscribe wherever you're listening or watching. Go to kimdsnyder.com slash 071.